Hey everybody, welcome to the Letters page, I'm Sal. I'm Ethan. And I'm Tiffany. This is the show where we open up letters and packages from you, the population at large, by checking the description box below this video. You too can find our P.O. Box address. It's not hidden very easily, so you can just find it. And use it and send us a letter, package, or any other number of things that these delightful people have done. We're going to open them up here on the show. Let's jump into it. Tiffany, take it away. Uh, I'm going to open up this one. Great. All right. Good, good choice. Yeah. Didn't see that coming. Oh. Usually Ethan goes first. I was relying on that. What happened? Yeah, he likes to he likes to mix it up. I do. Keeps things fresh. Often he gives us a choice, and then I don't like. like jump. Yeah, you waiting. don't like waiting, so yeah, you jump so in. I just, I just go. That's just from the company that's uh, that sold them the books. I, I'm just making sure there's nothing they added in. This is from Fred Bushy. Oh hey. Oh. Thanks, Fred. See. Long time uh, fan and, and uh, contributor to just, the show. Just yeah. saying. That's why I open these things and read them. Let's see what Fred sent. I'm getting it. What you got for us, Fred? Stuck. Uncanny X-Men. Ooh. Nice. There they are. Nice. From Kieran Gillen that, and... Oh. Is it Magic and, and her brother? Uh, and her brother, yeah. Oh, is that you, a lightsaber? Uh, no, that's no. a magic blade that she's creating. Oh. Yeah. But don't worry, it's it's not... Uh, it's written by... It's drawn by Greg Land, which is why it's impossible to tell what's going on. Um, but yeah. Cool. Thanks, man. Sweet. I'm excited. I have not... Uh, I don't remember Kieran Gillen's... Or Keith Giffen's... It doesn't, I don't know. I don't remember this run. I'll have to read it. Kieran Gillen. Kieran Gillen, thank you. There you this go. This is right there. Yeah. Well, thanks, Fred. Cool. Next. Did Kieran Gillen work on um, Wicked and Divine? Uh, yes. Nice. Oh, man! Uh-oh. I opened up to the best page. Yeah. It's Abigail Brand. She, uh, X-Men creation. And technical mutant. Yes. So Fox has her. Which is uh, why Sword is not in the MCU. Oh, really? Which yeah. sucks. Yeah. That sucks. Dear Comic Pop, oh. thank you for opening my lax package on the show, and I hope it happens again. <gasps> it is. It's happening right now. Uh, the fact that Tiffany has the Sheriff Strange badge on her Twitter banner makes me very happy. I got the 3D printer up and running again, and I'm sending more things. Your Aww. fridge magnet game is about to go to the next level. That's awesome. <laughs> I love you. that. I love that badge. Yeah. So much. Thank you for the hours of entertainment and being the goofy bunch of friends that we are all a part, uh, feel a part of. Aww. A few of the prints were a little fragile, so I wrapped them up for shipping purposes. Random questions while, while the package is opened by other members of the cast. When is the next Saga back issues? You know, I don't know. Because we noticed that, like, fewer folk were interested in, in seeing it. Yeah, it's so dropping kinda, off. We kind of just stopped. So, we'll see. But I, we've, I've heard a lot of people asking about it. I'm trying really hard not to break this while I open this Yeah. One. Um, so, maybe, maybe we will. Um, oh, man, you gave me the right one. Yeah. <laughs> oh, 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 nice. That rocks. That's awesome. As does this Ghostbuster No this Ghost sweet. logo. Oh, man. I had two in mine. Oh, oh cool. Um, this is the best one. Do you think we'll see Typhoid Mary in Daredevil Season 3? I'd, I, I would say yes. Because there are a few... Oh, cool. Check it out. It's a magnet, so it's like... <laughs> oh, my God! It's Rich Portal really Gun! Yeah. yeah. That's awesome. I, in case they can't see it, I wanted to announce right. what it was. Yeah. <gasps> I always see these at cons. Oh, nice! It's one of those Yoda Buddhas. It's Sweet. Yoda Buddha. Is uh, <laughs> yeah, I think so. And who could be the villain in a Hulk movie besides Red Hulk in the MCU? Nice. It's Thanos a bust. Thanos bust. That's cool. Uh, besides... Uh, the leader would suck. Yeah. Um, the abomination already sucked. Right. Yeah. Uh, we've seen the U.S. government as a villain in the in a Hulk movie, and that yeah. sucked. And uh, uh, just a regular old Plumbus. <laughs> yes. I always wondered how uh, Plumbus has got made. <laughs> Thank you, man. Uh, awesome. I think that the villain should be Iron Man. I want to see like an action, like just that Iron Man fight from Age of Ultron, but like mm -hmm. the whole movie. Why would they be fighting? Oh, like a misunderstanding. The same reason all superheroes fight like, for a whole movie. Yeah, it's a long time to maintain. A yeah, misunderstanding. basically, like they've run out of ideas, or they've they've filled up the roster of the the Avengers movie, uh -huh. so they don't need Hulk anymore. Sure. And then they're like, oh, but we want to make this Hulk movie. Let's make it where it's rampaging Hulk again, where he's just right. completely mindless. Right, and, right. And, and Stark's like, I don't trust anyone to stop him but me because he's my friend and I won't kill him. Right. Okay. And so it's him like, 
just agonizing over it. Meanwhile, Hulk's just like being the Hulk. Right. And it's well, just it, it, so Hulk is basically the villain of the movie, they, but unless you care about the they Hulk, they need to get Mysterio back, and then Mysterio could. <laughs> yeah. Have like, affected him. Yes. I mean, I didn't did, know there was more. I'm sorry. No, there is more. Keep going. Oh. Flash logo. That's pretty sweet. Oh, that's great. Somebody reach into logo. this magic sack. Uh, this is a uh, from population member Trace. P.S. Make sure to tell Rob that he may send out Rob Core rings to fans, but you have fans send you comic pop core rings. What? Ah! Nice. It's no face. Nice. That's awesome. And a coin. That's really He's cool. So cute. Man, <laughs> now I kind of want to see, and, and maybe someone already knows if this exists or not. <laughs> yeah. But wouldn't you like to see a Miyazaki chess game? Yes. All the characters. That would rock. Yeah. It probably exists already. Check it out. It's the Citadel. It's the Council of Ricks oh. logo. That rocks. This rocks. But not as much as these. We got some Red Lantern rings, but also. <laughs> I'm getting up to show. Comic pop core rings. <laughs> this is delightful. Yeah. These so, are amazing. We have fans send us comic pop core rings. Hope they fit. I guessed on a size and just went with it. Nice. These are great. Also got an orange lantern ring, oh. a red lantern ring, and these swell magnets of our logo wow. with our names on them. That's Jeez. awesome. This is like a lot of work. Yeah. That went into no. Ooh, and Blinky. On this instance. <laughs> that was nice. a fan. Yeah. I have a plush Blinky from uh, Universal Studios, which like I never thought I'd ever own. Man. These are great, man. These are great. This is really cool. Can you try that? Okay. Yeah, this one fits. All right. Thanks, Wait, dude. It does? Yes. It, is? it fits on my pinky. That's fine. Yeah. Ruh, rock. Yeah. Thank you, Trace. You rock, dude. I will uh, rub this in Rob's face, certainly. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> or it'll, he'll rub it in his own face, because I know Rob watches every show we do produce. Is so. he really? No. <laughs> He's like, what? <laughs> I am kidding. But... Uh, awesome. Wouldn't right, that be flattering on. if Let's... Rob commented in the bottom and was like, Oh, screw you guys, I definitely watch all your stuff. Okay. I'm going to try to put some of these out here, but I also don't want them to get damaged. No. But I still want people to see them. Yeah. This is, I, I don't know why I really like No Face. I mean, it's great. No these are all great. really, really it's cool. Like cool design. Yeah. I am very, really, really excited about these. These are great. All right, Ethan. Jump all in, right. man. All right. Was it Trace? Yeah. Thank you, Trace. Thank you, Trace. These are really, really cool. Rus. Ha! <laughs> oh, I spoke myself. <laughs> you can do it. <gasps> um, I'm doing it. A gift for you. After oh. seeing you guys talk about magic and Colossus's relationship, oh, here's one of my favorite looks at them. Hope you enjoy. Sorry about not getting them in one package. <laughs> That's okay. Oh. oh, is that from Fred? Oh, it could be. Yeah, from, from Fred. Yes, yeah, it is. It is. Nice. Hey. We're putting it together. I was gonna say. Well, that's kind of a coincidence. We literally have one of the. <laughs> oh. oh. Uh, and, oh, and a green-haired surprise for Tip. Yes! <laughs> we found it. And there's the first part, Avengers X Men, Uncanny X Men. It's awesome. Oh, cool. So I've got volume two. Nice. This is must be volume one. Yeah, yeah. it's by the same guy. Nice. Boom. Boom. Thank you. I, just like while you were opening up the other package, I was looking through here and like, oh my God, is Psylocke just? There is a moment I can't. I I didn't mark the page, but it's like clearly. Just a porn star yeah. being traced. Oh. Yeah, I was like, well, because, you know, they're screaming when they're going into battle and, you know, but they're still having a good time. And <laughs> what other what other uh, place would you find a woman screaming when she's having a good time? Jump in it. And I have to trace something. <laughs> no, it was this one. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I was like, yeah. Why would she be making that face right there? <laughs> right? If not because of the context of the panel, certainly. That's a good question. That is really funny. I'm going to open up this one because there's a chronological order here. I gotta, and I gotta trace I something. <laughs> I'm opening it! I opened it upside down. That's fine. Again, I know this is just the, the, the manifest, but. I thought this on the off chance. Uh, it's from Taylor! Hey! All right. I don't know where you're from, Taylor, but this is from you. Aww. <laughs> it is oh. DC's Stormwatch by Warren Ellis and Tom Rainey. Yay! 
Volume one. This guy's used to be Wildstorm huh. characters. Oh. Now. There's a lot of bubble tape wrapped like, here. Yeah, bubble tape. Because uh, bubble tape, it's six, six feet of wrapping. I didn't <laughs> for that, you. But Not I did. Um, you guys could just keep vamping. I'm, I'm going to be doing it. You're not, you're not doing anything yeah, for me. Yeah, we already did it. Just, yeah, thanks. Ta da! Stormwatch! Wow. <gasps> Sweet. Oh my goodness. God damn it. And uh, now it's written by Warren Ellis, so it's like, it looks like it's from the 90s, but it might be, like, not terrible. Okay. Uh, I don't remember, I did not read Stormwatch. By that point, I was so burned on comics, but even Image at that point, I was like, people are like, oh, Alan Moore's writing these, these amazing Image books. I go, uh, who's drawing it? And they're like, Rob Liefeld. And I'm like, uh-huh, bye. <laughs> <laughs> like, uh-huh, I think not. That's cool, man. Thank you. Taylor? Taylor. Taylor, thank you for Stormwatch, dude. If ever we wanted to do... St if we were ever going to do it... Now this we is, can. Now we can. Yeah. And it'll go into the Comic Pop Library. Uh, Stormwatch is... 96, 97? Yep. Yeah, by then I was like... I was on my way out. <laughs> could be Spider Guy in there? Yeah. This could be from Eric... Uh, because it has this, it has the first name Eric on the front. Oh, nice. Oh, are you are you parallaxing? Oh, okay. That's still cool. Yeah, I could do parallax too. <laughs> you can't have one of them. Ah, well, I guess I'll have to kill you <laughs> what? or uh, strand you in space. I mean. Oh no! Here's the other Tiffany surprise. It's literally <laughs> just an, a sword book. I, you know how many times I've seen this image? No. I've never I, seen this image. I have image. seen this image so many times of just her standing there like this. That's cool. I was like, that's awesome. So now I can actually read where this is from. Nice. I'm excited. I thought it's a Death's Head 2 in there. That's awesome. All right. Uh, yeah, what else is in here? My turn again? Yeah. Oh, jeez. You got Lucy oh, in the Sky and Beta Ray Bill. Wow. Yeah. Dude, this is like right up my alley. Yeah. This that's awesome. awesome. I can't that's wait. exciting. <laughs> I'm Hell Jordan. Yeah, I got that. I was... Don't worry, I didn't kill all the recipients of the rings. No, I, they're, 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 they, I, I left them, them just enough power to get home. To get home. Now I'm gonna destroy the power battery and leave them for dead. <laughs> it's Lockheed with dueling pistols. I know. That's cool. And a shotgun on his back. Oh well. Wow. It's awesome. That's really cool. I'm excited. Ooh, Marvel Boy. There's a lot of space stuff in here. Stuff. Package one of three from Hobgoblin Guy Russ. Oh, thanks, Hobgoblin Guy. What are the other packages? Uh, there could be in a pile of other packages, but for now, we've got Dragon <gasps> Ball, full color. Oh, that's neat. Wow. Holy cow. Yeah. Well, Kamehameha, guys. <laughs> I love being able to say that so, like, laissez faire. Yeah. Man. I watched a lot of Dragon Ball, and like it's funny because I know it's all in there, but like it's it never, I never have references for it, but I know I watched a lot of it. Yeah, it's up there somewhere. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, I watched some of it. I was, yeah. And I then stopped. Did. I was like kind of into it. There was like something about like the shonen style like animation and the sound effects and just the drama of it all. I was yeah. like, this is kind of cool. Mm -hmm. A lot of punching. There you go. Now you've completely nailed it. You have Hal Jordaned. We're going to have to... Maybe we'll have to take a picture for the Instagram or something. I'm guessing this is a hint. Yeah, I think somebody wants us to talk about Dragon Ball. Well, no. they know we're doing a manga book. They do. It's Not coming up. this. But it could be this. Yeah. Well, Tiffany, open up last one of these two packages here. Oh, do you want the box? No, take it. Yeah, take the box. All right. I'll take it. I'm pulling the tab to open. Oh, grab that guy. I rule. <laughs> I'm pulling the tab. Yeah. To open. Uh, I did it. Don't look. Okay. You already did. I'm excited for this. It's not awkward. It feels great. Yeah. <laughs> this is I'm like... like Xerxes. <laughs> it's not the lash they fear. Now put your hands creepily on South Shoulders. No, don't do it. <laughs> Oh, that's the worst moment. I'm like, is this movie going to take oh, a turn? Oh, <laughs> this is package two and three. Oh. Oh, from Hobgoblin? Yeah. Oh, all right, we got it. All right. We did it. Thank you so much, Hobgoblin. We totally worked it. I hate that it's worked it. I really want it to be worth it. Yeah, yeah. I prefer worth it. 
And Garth Ennis, the shadow, the fire of creation. Okay, I remember this book. Whoa. I never read it, though. But Garth Ennis' The Shadow sounds ridiculous. <laughs> there you go. Cool. And the thing that I'm particularly excited about that's in here. He-Man, Thundercats. Oh, oh yes! <laughs> published by DC. That's awesome. Written by Rob David. I did not know that was a thing. If you want to see this on back issues, let us know in the comments down below. I want to do this, so we'll see what happens. This art <laughs> is awesome. It's by Freddie E. Williams II. Oh, man. Popularized by the Batman Ninja Turtles Whoa, crossover. Oh, I just saw something I shouldn't have seen. Uh-oh. I'm not going to say that. I'm not even going to tell you. Okay. I'm not even going to tell you what I just saw. Good. Dude, this is they awesome. did do a DC versus He-Man, which we also have. And, uh... That's epic, too. But He-Man, Thundercats, that's like, yeah. 30 years in the making. Here you go. I All I want to see is Skeletor and Mumra hanging out. I, there's no way <laughs> that won't happen. So badly. It's, who wrote this? Rob Davids. I don't know who that is. I don't know either, but like, <laughs> dude, good on you. Yeah, thank you for making our dreams come true. This is awesome. And thanks, Hobby. This is amazing. That's Hob, what... Hobgobby? That's what Spider-Man calls him. Hobby. Hobby. All right, and the final one. Oh God, you know, you know, Freddy would have done it for free. He's so cool. But he's very happy he didn't have to do that. He's so cool. I met Freddy E. Williams the second at uh, Baltimore Comic Con. Oh. He's also uh, he drew the Space Cop poster and uh, the Horse Ninja poster for uh, for Red Letter Media. Horse Ninja? I'm not even familiar with that. What? <sighs> well, it's ridiculous. <laughs> what? There's just a... There's a... Does Battle Cat become a Thundercat? It says Battle Cat Man. Well... <laughs> well, like... <laughs> that's Ranger happening. Ranger can talk. Yeah, so I guess he can become a Cat Man. Ah, yeah, my Cat Man. <laughs> this one is from Preston. Comic Club! Preston from Corpus Christi, Texas, checking in. You guys have the best YouTube channel on the internet. Thank you very Thank much. Thank you. And I just wanted to send you guys some books you may not have read yet. Keep on cranking out the best stuff on the internet, and I hope you like the books. I hope you like the painting as well. <gasps> Preston... Thank you so much, man. I love when people send us art. We'll do the books first. Oh. <laughs> yes! Mike Allred's X-Force. Wow. And Neil Gaiman's Mr. Hero. Oh! Cool. I wonder if this is... Hang on. Let me see when this is from. Because this might be one of those early things that he worked on. It looks like it. Before he hit it big with um, Sandman. I mean, he was already big as a, a writer. Yeah. Nope, this is 95. Cool. Neil Gaiman and Allred's X-Force, which features Dupe. Dupe. <laughs> yep, a fan favorite character. <laughs> you know what other Neil Gaiman books you can get? Lady Justice and Technophage. Technophage. It's metaphorical! <laughs> <laughs> this is awesome. Art is crazy. Oh, cool. It's Swamp Thing. Oh, I love it! That's, That's awesome. really good, this man. This is great, man. That is great. Preston. Yeah, you right? signed it. Yeah, Thank it's on you. the back. Oh, hey. Nice. Preston, this is great. Love it. It's going right up in the studio. Yes, Thank it you is. so much. Yep. Awesome. I really love it. Well, that about wraps her up for this episode of Letters Page, Thanks. ladies and gentlemen. I want to thank you all for watching the show. I want to thank my amazing co-hosts for, of course, joining us on the show and making this show possible by showing up and letting us shoot shows with you every week and also for you for watching them. Uh, hey, thank you all so much. But if you want to participate, you can always do so by checking the description box below this video. Grab the P.O. box address. Use it to send us a letter, package, postcard. Uh, you know, whatever, as long as it's a, it's legal and uh, not weird and creepy, and not take glitter, it. and, not, a and not glitter. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, thank you guys so much, and we'll see you guys next week. I'm Sal. I'm Ethan. I'm Tiffany. Bye. 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 This is great.